Yeah, uh, you get the point. You know, it's just a generic thing to, you know, if you're going to talk about anything Halloween 3 related, you have to pop that little shanty in to kind of announce it. So, uh, but anyway, before I jump into talking about some Halloween 3 things, um, I would like to give a late birthday shout out to Hobbs Horror. His birthday was on Monday, uh, April 19th, I believe. So, if you're not already uh, subscribed to his channel, go subscribe to that guy. Super awesome fellow, very supportive of my channel, um, and just puts out a lot of cool, fun stuff, and does that uh, midnight hour uh, little YouTube podcast, and I mentioned it in a few videos before to go hit him up. Um, but it's his birthday. If you want to give him a late birthday present, go subscribe to his channel, because that's a very simple, effortless way to give him a really cool gift by just click and subscribe on them. Um, and then I'm gonna also do another little birthday greeting um, to my friend Bo Cooper, who has a channel called Hops and Horror. Not Hobbs Horror, but Hops and Horror. So he does really cool movie reviews. Um, I do get a lot of cool products from him. He uh, hooks me up with some uh, rad stuff. Super awesome guy. Um, but yeah, either go hit him up on YouTube or on Instagram as well. Um, I will put links in the description area below below me. So anyway, uh, box, which has something Halloween 3-ish in there. Ish. I also haven't put any of videos up for a while. I've um, just been too busy and... Uh, haven't really had anything to really talk about, so when a package showed up, I'm like, yes, let me crack you open and blabber on this camera machine to uh, put out a video, which is more than just me standing around pushing play on a computer, like doing the streams that I've done the last few times, which I know a few of you enjoy that, but, um, you know, I mean, it's just me for two hours, bop, 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 clicking a mouse. Dragging some crazy tunes in, that kind of thing. But uh, anyway, this uh, box comes from House of Mysterious Secrets. I did pre-order the uh, Waxwork Records uh, Trick or Treaters set. Um, only one has come, because apparently they only released one. Um, my little invoice thing. Uh, House of Mysterious Secrets consistently packs the stuff in very well. I'm always very pleased with it. Um, there's never really been a time, I think, I had a magazine that was slightly bent. That was it. I mean, out of like a bajillion orders that I'd done with them, uh, that is the only flaw. So that has been great from them. Um, so I'm just going to tell you, if you're not familiar with the Waxwork uh, record spinner top things, uh, these things are absolutely beautiful. Look at this freaking thing. I mean, sure, they're a little, you know, I think they're like 20 some odd dollars, but uh, super, super worth it. I mean, the box looks beautiful, um, great packaging, and that's him right there. Uh, generally, stuff like this I'm not going to open up, but um, this one I'm going to crack open because uh, it just needs to happen. So I'm going to give you uh, an unboxing unboxing. So you're getting me taking it out of the actual box, and then me actually taking him out of his... Uh, cardboard crypt box thing so here it is definitely uh has a nice heavy weight to him um oh no so he is submerged in there um hopefully well i'm sure it'll be okay if not that's why you buy another one if you screw it up so I'm just going to cut him loose. A tough one. All right. Got it. <clears throat> Almost free. There he 
is yeah that is super solid so let me uh get in there so the detail on the sculpt is super awesome i am super happy with that even down to the uh little silver shamrock on the back of his head right there When the others come in, I am super stoked on the collection. So if you guys haven't already gotten one of these, um, I am not 100% sure if House of Mysterious Secrets has any more um, left of these up on the website. Um, if they do, uh, definitely get it. Yep, so it looks like he just goes right back in easily. So uh, I am stoked on that. So it's not like a neck of figure, you open that thing up, there's a bajillion pieces all over the place and it's just not an easy put back. Um, but this was definitely a super easy put back. So you can totally take them out, put them back in the box. Personally, I prefer to have them kind of like that so it's nice and easy. Um, probably gonna shove it in front of the NECA box uh, from Halloween 3, so. But yeah, that's uh, it guys, just wanted to kind of show off that cool uh, spinature from uh, Waxwork Records. Um, if, again, if you haven't f been familiar with their little series of spinatures, um, I would hit them up because they are super beautiful and awesome. That's it for this video, guys. Um, as usual, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Click that little bell notification button. That way you know when I put up a new video. Till next time, it's been real. Oh, and then also, it is Thursday today, so I will be streaming again tonight. So if you want to see my dumbass wobble around, push play on a laptop, and just hang out with me and chat and all that stuff, uh, that will be commencing 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. tonight. The One moment, please. Uh, Thursday, April 22nd. There we go. Yes.